Hi, I'm Davis. I'm Andy. We're the Game Grazers. And we are revolutionizing in Red Faction. We left you off in the middle of cutscene things, but we don't care. It doesn't matter. I think I'm supposed to kill these guys. We're going to yeah. find out. Yeah. So, oh, so no, they're good guys. Don't shoot them. <laughs> so so I tweeted out um, to people. It's like, hey, say something to us. Maybe we'll get on the show. And um, Hel Helix101, who is who's ever our bro, is um, he asks... Would you rather have permanent Cheeto dusted fingers or taste buds on your asshole? Wow. So if I had taste buds on my asshole, I'd have like a like a secondary flavor exp explosion. <laughs> I'm totally going for the um, taste buds on my asshole. Um, I think I'd rather have like Darius, permanent Cheeto dusted fingers. I, I don't want to taste my shit. <laughs> Well, if you're like me, you have other people's shit going through your butthole. God damn it. I gotta find the cultists. I'm gonna reply to him. Why would you ask that? <laughs> he wants my ass inside? Maybe his ass has taste buds in it. <laughs> I honestly think that would, that would lead to a flavor sensation because then you would have food that um you needed like like it would taste okay being eaten but then it would taste even better digested <laughs> that is a food technology we need right now duncan hines <laughs> betty crocker <laughs> i'm talking to you <laughs> conagra they're not nearly so friendly as duncan hines duncan hines ah uh. Well, Nestle can go suck a dick with all their slave labor. <laughs> okay, what am I doing? I have to eliminate cultists. Yep. Yeah. So, so that's the kind of fun you could possibly get into if you were to follow us on Twitter at Game Grazers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's fucking creature from the Black Lagoon. That, that's pretty Check crazy. Check that shit out. Wait, I want to teabag him. Yes. So, dear, yeah. dear, dear listeners, why don't why don't you answer Helix's question? How yeah, about you? Yeah. Wait, do you want? Wait, now I'm gonna suck his dick. Watch this. Oh baby, oh baby, oh baby. Oh, okay. I can stop that shit. Okay, so fine, fine. You've been eliminated. <laughs> you have been eliminated. Consider that a divorce. I got more cultists. Oh, I heard back from Helix. It's a game of would you rather. Have fun with that one. Lol. Either choice. We lose. <laughs> I totally agree with that assessment. We already did. Oh my god! Give me what I got. It's kind of fun to have that sort of like live interaction while we're actually like filming, even though it's not like streaming. Speaking of which, we've started streaming, sort of, on Twitch. We're twitching yes. now. We are twitching. Yes. Jesus. Fuck. <laughs> headshots. Headshots for everybody. <laughs> Motherfuckers. All the headshots. Yeah. So Twitch. Is kind of fun. Um, it is. It kind of late to the game here. Um, I think we have two counts against us. First of all, we're guys. Yes. Next of all, we're not Canadian. I'm not sure why, but a lot of Canadians stream. Perhaps it's that time of year. I don't know. I, I don't know. Well, a lot of Canadians are also Let's Players. I know a quite fair a number of Let's Players who are Canadian. I think are, Helix uh, is Canadian. I'm not sure. Brethren to the uh, Great White North. North. Yeah. One of them, though, uh, Couch Pals, he, he is definitively Canadian. Canadian. He, he is He's from Quebec. He has See. that kind of voice that that's like just screams. I also speak French. Oui, oui. <laughs> okay, I don't know if that's useful or not, but uh, I guess we better just keep going. <laughs> Helix, I mean, how annoying would it be touching everything and getting Cheeto dust and stains everywhere? I know. <laughs> that reminds me of a joke about a guy who went to the doctor with an orange Their dick. Has been restored on I, the I, I don't even want to know. Uh, fine, okay. I, I should tell Helix to stop. Um, uh, giving you fuel. <laughs> I already have plenty of fuel. Prepare Please. this, bitch. Please stop fueling Andy. It is not going well. <laughs> My sanity is at risk. <laughs> this looks like magical. Wait, do I want to add a little bit more? <laughs> yes! Alright, let's follow this motherfucker. That's, that's a nice, like, Here's where things are going. Give me a sit rep, Sam. Yep. No movement detected in the cargo bay. Open the pavé doors, Hal. I can't do that, Dave. <laughs> Open the pavé doors, Hal. I need to watch more 2001. I've not. I haven't watched it in years. I've never seen it. 
This seems to become a trend. Andy says, this movie's amazing. I go, I've never seen this movie. I could totally make shit up about movies then, right? Like, yeah, how it's terrible in 2001 when they go to Jupiter and they uncover the lusty ladies of Jupiter. Knowing enough about Stanley Kubrick, that both sounds impossible and completely plausible. Well, you totally need to watch, uh, what the fuck was Eyes that? Wide Shut. Eyes Wide Shut, man. That's why I said it sounds plausible and also not plausible. I have no idea what I'm doing. I never know what you're doing. Where's the nanoforge? Where's my nanoforge? <laughs> I'm getting electrified. Justified. Petresteride. Petresteride? Projectoride. What the oh god, hell? I'm about to get fucked. So, so today I was watching a video which was uh, Kevin Smith talking about how he was working on a right for like a Superman movie in the 90s. Uh huh. And how it, like the producer of it was just this really weird kooky guy and he just like. And it, eventually Superman, like, he can't wear his suit, he can't fly, and at the end he has to fight a giant spider. Uh. And, like, this dude was just like really freaking weird, didn't understand Superman at all. <laughs> and then later on, he's like, I got reminded about working on the Superman thing because I saw a movie he produced later that summer called Wild Wild West. Uh, <laughs> In which at the end, there's a giant mechanical fight. Wow, he's like, he loved that idea, huh? He's Apparently. And I thought you were going to tell me it was uh, Zack Snyder. <laughs> okay, where's the fucking terraformer? Press X hold to enter the terraformer. Oh. Maybe you're in a... Onto the, the breach achievement. End of file. Erectile dysfunction fucker. It's EDF. Oh, Earth Defense Forces. But you're on Mars. Well, that's the challenging part. I mean, it's, it's just like if in Iraq you fight the U.S. Army. Right? I guess. You follow that logic? No. Impact is online. Man, that was freaking awesome. I want one of those. <laughs> What am I doing? Oh, oh, tap RB. It's like a, it's like a, um, shout. Mason, what's your status? Oh, Hello, okay. I know, this is the dragon shout. Good. Yes. The cultures have tripped down near every security system in the building. Oh, through down. Every sector is on lockdown. Oh, shit. You'll need to clear each one for the system to boot. Yes, yes sir. <laughs> Dova King. <laughs> Dragonborn. <laughs> How much Skyrim have you played? A lot. Really? Yes. Okay. Not well compared to others. Not very much at all. <laughs> For me, I think I put about ninety hours into it. Oh, that's that's respectable. I mean, you yeah. know, that's like having the eight-inch long that. dick at the porn yeah. shoot. You know, it's good. It's good. Oh my god. Why? Why must everything come back to porn with you? Uh, you want to know? I don't want to know. Okay, actually, I'll tell you. Don't. Oh. I, I'd rather. I'd rather not know. I'll let your imagination run wild. <sighs> okay. I can't pick any of this shit up. I'm full of everything. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and shock the shit out of this. Well, you're full of shit. I can tell you that. Ew. Should we repeal it? Oh crap! Fart noises. Nothing but the best here at Game Grazers. We provide you with top-notch humor. Quality A1, Grade A USDA. Okay. Oh my god. I'm gonna just fucking do that to you, bitch. I keep expecting Dennis Hopper to step out with camera around his neck. <laughs> hey, man. I don't know, like, in this kind of scenario, I kind of sort of, like, come out with weird, really greased hair like in Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> his best troll ever, oh. by the way. <clears throat> uh, Bob so, Hoskins says that was the worst filmmaking experience he's ever had. He didn't survive it. He's dead now. Yes. So uh, is Dennis Hopper. Yes, he is. All, all we have left is John Leguizamo. Oh, and he's got an amazing set of talent somehow, somewhere. <laughs> he's he was, not in a lot. He was on a, there was like a, a situation, or like a sketch comedy, like a Hispanic focused sketch comedy show on uh, Fox once upon a time. He was also in Tu Wong Fu, Thanks for Everything, Julie Newmar. Oh, yeah. That to me was like the, I don't know. I sort of liked uh, Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, which I think predated it. Like somebody watched that and said, "You know what, America, we gotta do that movie." Well, we can talk about um, <clears throat> cross-dressing uh, movies next time on Game Grazers. Oh, oh, can we talk about Divine and John Waters? Let's do that next time. I, I want to talk about <clears throat> the Birdcage. 
<laughs> Nathan Lane, baby. <laughs>